Hey guys, how's it going? Counter Baron here. Welcome you guys back to even more of Diablo the Hell Mod single player playthroughs featuring the Paladin class on Purgatory. Almost stumbled there, but I caught myself. I caught myself, so no need to worry about that. We raised took care of the Chamber of Bone, and now we're on our way down to level 7. So let's get it on the way. One. Before we do, let's check out character stats and inventory. You see, right now we're currently at level 32. Uh, you also see the strength, magic, dexterity, vitality in terms of base for now. You see the life, the mana, the armor class, the hit percentage damage, and the all resist in terms of magic fire, lightning, and the damage from enemies. And you can also see the current experience we have and the experience required for next level. Switch our gears around between uh, what was it? The primary offhand weapon versus the secondary for the range, and you can see that the stat difference. You can see that there's quite a a decent difference there, but let's go ahead and check our inventory out. Currently have Shadow Prince as our as our blade, except the Doom as our bludgeon, and both of these are in the reserves. We have Mango of the Sky, Fleshbrand, Arcane's Valor, Obsidian Crown of the Sky, Guiding Call of the Sky, Loris's Parry, Obsidian Bangle of Accuracy. And we still use our obliterator for our ranged weapon in case we actually need it. So Let's make our way down to level 7. Let's do it. restart that because that actually ended up a lot worse than I thought it would. So now that I know the threat, let's assess the situation this way first. Hmm. Makes me wonder if they're even in the fire. Well, it looks like I might just be done. a bit scary. See? That difficulty ramp again between level 6 and 7. In my opinion, I think it's a little too substantial how they just do that. But at the same time, that's what can really make this mod challenging in any given moment. So you don't want to take that element of surprise away from the game. I did not foresee this. There was no way I could have foreseen that. That's crazy. Let's identify this dagger here. And Hello, my friend. Highlighting dagger. Then Greetings. Uh, get away. Greetings. Repair the gear. Yeah, we repair the gear. We're good. Right. What ails you, my friend? I 
Ethan's will probably be. Well, he's definitely one of my toughest levels yet. No doubt about it. Let's go back in. Save immediately before we progress any further. Or so help me, I just might lose again. Uh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, there's some kind of enemy nearby. But as soon as I hit this area, there it is. See, I had a feeling that was going to happen, and that's exactly what happened. Okay, we're going to do this again, and I actually need to position myself right here. Okay. Oh, oh my freaking gosh. Oh my gosh, this is what's happening again. I keep getting surrounded, and that's the last thing I want to happen. Someone open the door. I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one who heard that. Some, someone or something opened the door. Oh my gosh. Reload again. I'm really hoping I catch a good break here. Because I don't want goat men to just suddenly appear and I have to deal with them in melee. So we did it. I think that was just really. This was, I think it was just really bad RNG. Levels are already preset the moment that you start a new game, but it was more or less like how the maps. It's. I guess it really just boils down to like how you approach the maps, despite how predetermined they actually are. Uh, we got more 
that. Yeah, we got more of that apparently. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Why am I doing this to myself? Stay out of the room, let him come to you, man. Last, last two, I mean. I was gonna say last one, but I meant to say last two. And that's it. Thank goodness for that, huh? Anyway. Is this shrine gonna be any good besides the previous ones I gotten? Because I need um, attribute boost. Mm, those are to defend, saw them attack. Wait, what was that again? New load game. This arm of blessing. Ravager just had to appear. Okay, now you're gone. I think this law applies for just about any melee undead. Yeah, undead melee, you don't want them to touch you because they take down your health and mana. Life, mana, health, mana. Uh, it's whatever at this point. I just don't want any of them to touch me. Oh my gosh. Appreciate that. We go from 71 to 72. And I'm doing it again, like a fool. Yeah. Last thing I need is for those ranged monsters to, uh, ranged attackers to punish me for free. need to put those relics in good use, especially since I have a spell of town port I can use any time. Hello, my friend. Hmm. Here we go. And repulsion and greetings. Really, there are three quests that you can do on the 
catacombs. One of them is Arcane's Valor, the second one is the Chamber of Bone, and the third, I believe, would be Halls of the Blind. And here they come again. Usually entails something really terrible is going to happen. obvious just TK that I get the chance but better yet we can use trap disarm for field mail oh these guys are cheap really if that's not savage I don't know what is anymore Is that exactly... Is that a circle going on? I wouldn't be surprised if there is. But let me check this area around first. Save before it. My goodness. just what I needed. That's exactly what I needed. I have no room for this crap. Well, of course you don't. So level 7 at the beginning was pretty difficult, it forced me to rethink my strategy Hello, my now to undergo the entire map, but so far I'm Greetings. seeming to be, I seem to be winging it pretty well. Alright, let's do this. Right side is that I get some really good ex experience from this. So long as I can keep them at bay like this, is the only real bright side I can see.
Button that you end up hitting the number two button instead. All right, we're good. And we're gonna shock here. Just use a simple repair for the. There we go. I can read this. That's good. This is gonna be spell level three, I believe. Yep, spell level three. Holy ball. Level four. That's cool. I'll, I'll take it anyway. Oh, I forgot one. The fourth will be Zara the Mad. So that's Chamber of Bone, Halls of the Blind, Arcane's Valor, and Zara the Mad. That's four, not three. Hello, my friend. Oh, what am I doing? Preparing. Greetings. That's what I'm doing. I really need to get around to clean this area up. I will. Things wrong? We'll find out. Okay, we're safe. I do have another relative trap this on. Perhaps I should use that. I have no room for this crap. And it's just another potion of mana. There's no doubt about it, there are a lot of girls in this area. Or just her to look at it. Mm -hmm. 
You're not even magical, you're basic. This one. I don't have the magic for it, so snatch that one. And it looks like we're good. Also, I'm gonna repair gear again. Greetings! Just because we can. <laughs> Excuse me. Let's see how it is. What else we got here? Is that all? Oh crap. I thought it was something else. Oh. Long Shrine Room. space to a large room like this one. Oh my gosh. That definitely spelled trouble. With extreme confirmation. I just did anyway. Gosh, I need time to heal. Now I can go. say I can spray I mean I could literally spray these arrows at you so let's let's keep going oh my gosh Ooh, the epic dodge deal with it are we good Yes, we are good. Succubi did, definitely didn't see that coming. I was at that much health. Managed to get away. Don't you hate it whenever you're playing your game, when you're playing your favorite game, whether it's fighting or whether it's like a MOBA or whether it's an RPG with like PvP elements, and your opponent just seems to get away with like the smallest sliver of health possible will you just suddenly die oh my gosh that's gotta be the worst feeling ever you were that close to beating them and then suddenly poof, it's all gone anyway here's another shrine and hopefully it'll give me a strength boost power may come from knowing yourself wait what is that what is what is am i am i lost Okay, let me let me do that again. Power may come from knowing yourself. All right, so more vitality. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely more vitality. 
power may come from knowing yourself is vitality. I still have yet to see the riddle. The sword of justice is swift and sharp. Oh my gosh. Savage. Tell you what. I got TK for you, man. Deal with the TK. Oh gosh. Yeah, you can't deal with it. Because your trap arrows are savage, man. Anyway, I think that's another shrine room, so I'm gonna go ahead and open the store. Ah, what the freak. That can't be all of them. To it. Alright. Is this gonna be the one? Is it gonna be the shrine? Please let it be the shrine. I can't wait for it to be the shrine. Let it be the shrine. Okay, some experience gained by touch. Okay, I can appreciate that. I can appreciate that. It won't take me so long to get to level 33. I was down to level 8. Wait, that can't be everything. We still have a good bit of a level to complete, which means we have to, we have to backtrack now. Ah, uh, sucks. That's life. I gotta deal with it. I'm not complaining, I'm just having fun. If I were really complaining, you know. my And I have a strong tendency to just cope with things in life. I don't complain about anything. And that's like a 90%. What was it? It's like a 95% chance that I won't complain. The other 5% chance, when I do complain, is for a legitimate reason. It's for a legitimate reason. But it's not really about gaming. Gaming is meant to be having fun anyway, so... If people were to truly rage at a game, and start slamming their controllers down and stuff like that, then they have some serious issues that they need to work out. Just saying, just saying. Anyway, you got another battle going on? There he is. Yeah, took you down, son. Huh? Go, man. Uh oh. It's minions? No, they're not minions. The reason I was concerned about them being minions or not is because, as you already know, minions are just like downright strong like, they're just a lot stronger than the base um, version of said character and that lightning just completely missed me because I dodged it like a boss anyway looks like that'll be it for level 7 and thank goodness for that it took a good minute but I beat it I definitely conquered it so the next time I'm doing runs I'm just going to skip um, Cathedral entirely, and I'm just going to keep doing Catacombs and Caves until I get to the levels I need. Because I'm noticing that I definitely get a whole lot more experience in Catacombs than I ever will in Cathedral. And I did all four, um, I did all four levels of the Cathedral for like the third time, and I haven't gained a single level. So let's see what we got in terms of everything else here. Let's say we're good. We don't really need to go to. Um, we don't really need to go to Griswold for anything. So I'm just gonna save right here and wrap it up. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, I sincerely thank you all for your time. Until we meet again on the next one, this is Counter Baron signing off, saying take good care of yourselves out there. Stay strong. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Stay out of trouble. And have a good one. Respect your elders out there.